Asheville police say an arsonist is on the loose tonight. Already, someone has torched four vacant buildings in the city. Some of those fires happened in the River Arts District near downtown, where dozens of artists make a living. News 13's Mario Boone is live there tonight. And Mario, you talked to some of them. What's their biggest fear? Well, they're worried the arsonists will graduate from empty buildings like this and move to occupied studios like this, and that someone will get hurt if this person isn't caught soon. One week after a fire bug torched this vacant building in Asheville's bustling River Arts District, fire investigators back on the scene looking for clues. <laughs> It's one of four arsons in the first week of April under investigation, a cause in two more fires yet to be determined. It's a very dangerous situation. Particularly for artists like Eileen Black, who fear the next fire might be at their gallery. All of Asheville is, is very concerned. Black says fellow merchants in Cotton Mill Studios can't afford hiring security, so they're relying on other ways to keep the arsonist at bay. We've always had 24-hour surveillance on the building. And um, so we, we feel pretty good about that, with lots of cameras and security as far as that goes, mm -hmm. and, and lots of alarms, okay. and a fire sprinkler system. Meanwhile, she's hoping investigators catch the person responsible before more damage is done, or worse, someone gets hurt. Everybody's eyes are open more. Everybody's watching and being much more careful. Of course, if you have any information about these fires, you are urged to contact Asheville Police Crime Stoppers phone number 828-255-5050. Reporting live in the River Arts District, I'm Mario Boone, News 13.